What's up YouTube? This is Cooking with Doug. And what you see here is my brand new Instant Pot Plus Mini. I'll put the link in the description where I got it on Amazon. It's about a hundred bucks. All right, that's what she's looking like right there. Check out those buttons. Okay. Matter of fact, so on the right is my old one. Um, and that is the, what is that? The, is it the seven in one? And then this one I got is the nine in one. And so the new one that I got is more of a digital display and, um, and so forth. But let me plug it in. I just want to kind of go side by side and just see if I can notice any differences. I see, of course, the new one has extra buttons, extra features, but pretty much the same. I like the display, and then, you know, with this one, the new one I got gives you more control of um, what you're cooking. And we'll get into that a little later. By the way, this is going on Craigslist as we speak for about 35 to 40 bucks. All right, let's look what it comes with. Of course, this is our breakaway cord. Not long, not short. Typical. All right, just pop the top. And take out everything out of there. Remember to take this out. Don't burn down your house. I love that look. Stainless steel when you just open it. And your um, pressure cooker, awesome. Okay, did it come with this uh, rack? Did come with these. There's you two, which is cool. I never use this, but I appreciate it. Might use it as like a mouthwash cup. No, I'm just kidding. Let me go ahead and put this on the back. Should snap in right there. Let's look at the top real quick. Nothing fancy about that. Typical instant pot. I have a drawer full of these. I like to put these on my appliances. So just in case I, I do my videos on my island in my kitchen. So I usually have an extension cord run to, um, to my island. So. I have to have something like this on the three prong. So I just put them on all my appliances because you never know. Okay, turned it on for the first time. I like it. Hit me. Not cooking anything at the moment, but I am going to do a water test for you guys and we'll see. Uh, We'll test out the some of the buttons and functions and see how it goes. I am going to do a video on making something later on today with this, but for now, we'll just do a water test on the unboxing. That's fair. All right, so I'm going to pour one cup of water in there. Okay. All right, so what do we want to do here? Um... Let's just go to right into pressure cook and see. Oh, uh, see, see, it says normal and high. So, pressure level. So, I could go low and high. I like that. So, I'm gonna bring it all the way down to two minutes. Is there a start button? No. Oh, pressure level, what's, okay, we did that already. So how do I, I'll figure that out later. But yeah, let's just do a normal run and see how it goes. And while that's going, I forgot to show you this. Fourth edition, look at that. 
a recipe booklet. See if I see anything good. Okay. Okay. So anyway, you get the point. It's about what 48 pages of recipes. Here's your manual. Yeah. Quick reference. Does this say? Just preset cooking times, temperatures. Okay. All right, be back in two minutes. All right, it's all done. It does beep about six times, but I didn't catch it, but we're done, so we're gonna release uh, the pressure. All right. There it is. So we did our water test. We know it works. Cool. Another cool thing I want to show you is you can um, you can hang your lid on the side just like that. Either side actually. The other side. Let's put it in there real easy. And before I go, I have it in saute mode and just I just want to see what that looks like when it gets to that. Um, I use that a lot in um, pressure cookers so just want to see, I guess, share with you guys what it looks like when, um, when it gets to saute, when it gets to the um, temperature of whatever that is in saute mode. All right, just thumbing through the manual, and I see that this pressure cooker has this, um, what do you call it, sanitize button. And I was looking through it, and it says, oh, not sanitized, sterilized, sorry. So sterilizing of utensils and canning um, fruits and vegetables. Okay. I have to check that out, but that's a added feature to this. But... That's pretty much all I got on this, guys. I just wanted to do a quick unboxing, show you guys. Some of you guys might have been looking about getting this one. This one's about a hundred bucks. Um, so, like the six in one that I'm giving away on my, if you guys saw, or my subscribers saw on my uh, thirty thousand landmark video that I'm giving that away tonight. Um, well, I'll be buying it and just shipping it to whoever wins. Um, that one is, I think, fifty nine bucks. Then you have the seven in one, which is the one that this is replacing. Um, that's about seven, 69 to 79, depending on where you buy it. And then now this one's $99. This one right here is 99 bucks. So I just wanted to upgrade to this one because just that's just what I do. Shout out to my kitchen gadgets group on Facebook. Shout out to my pressure cooking group um, called Pressure Cooking with Doug. I'll put a link into the description to that. That's my pressure cooker group, guys. Whatever um, pressure cooker you got, whether it be Instant Pot, it could be a Kasori, it could be um, a Go Wise, it could be whatever. Uh, make sure you join my group. It's a great group. Um, share your recipes, best practices. You can get recipes in my um, pressure cooker group as well. But, and the link will be in the description to this pressure cooker. Um, but enough of me talking. Just wanted to share it with you guys real quick. If you like if you like it remember to subscribe and if anything thanks for just even looking at my video it is cooking with